Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 daily notification video. In this video, I covered the daily challenges and how to complete them. Also, we, I covered the Atomic Shop if there are any uh, deals or special offers ending within the next 24 hours, which is not the case in this video. All the section uh, new sale every day, all of the items are open and they all last until the 7th of January. So today, we're only going to cover the daily challenges and how to complete them, plus, the look to be pretty easy so let's stop wasting time and jump right into it all right so let's take a look at the daily challenges and once again happy new year everybody I hope you had a wonderful new year's Alright, so let's take a look at the challenges section. And at the end of the video, I also want to mention something in regards to the community post that I made this morning. I got a little bit freaked out, but everything looks to be good. And uh, yeah, I'll co cover that once we're done with daily challenges, alright? Okay, so collect uh, 100 caps. That is uh, actually pretty simple. Uh, as far as I know, you can do this just by selling stuff to the vendor, so you should be good. Uh, but we're gonna run a quick test over here. Uh, cook meals with plants or uh, fungi. So basically, I made a little test. I picked up uh, corn, uh, like the most searchable plant <laughs> uh, in this game. I'll show you the location uh, that the, where I picked it up, but there are way more locations. Uh, and you can cook it and get your 10 atoms, uh, collect caps, get 10 atoms, hack a terminal, I have one in mind, uh, that's one of the, uh, I'll show you the location, I'll show it to you how to do it on the video, and kill a cryptid, I know where to get one. Uh, also level up uh, while completing any uh, three sub challenges, so level up once so I'll uh, level 76 or higher, this one I will do automatically. Level up in Flatwoods or Arctis Pharma under level 20, wearing responder gear, fast nash mask at the water park under level 30, uh, death ball island, yielding a protest sign in a group, naked, <laughs> engaged in PvP, Vault 94 or 96. Personally myself, I don't think I'll be able to complete this one today. And Nuclear Winter, I might even gonna do it uh, if I'll have time to play. Because I'm not sure if I'll have some time to play Nuclear Winter today. So, anyway, let's start off with uh, cook, cook meals with plants. Then we'll do the, the caps, then we'll do the terminal, and then we'll do the cryptid. And that should give us 50 quick atoms. So, if you navigate uh, to your food station, obviously you'll need boiled water and some corn or any other plant. As far as I understand, they all should work. So, corn is the easiest one for me. One, two, three, four. There we go. We got our 10 atoms, super easy. Now, them, I usually always come over here because there's uh, a lot of food over there. And that's where I pretty much pick everything up. So, Silva Homestead, plus there's a spot where you can uh, loot the junk items, scrap them for acid, and usually get around 50 acid, so I pretty much visit this place every day. Uh, now, uh, caps. So, let's go check out my theory about selling stuff to the vendor works, but it should work because I remember this event popping a, a long time ago, by the way. I haven't seen this event for some time now, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Alright, so we are at the vendor and let's sell him some stuff and get some caps. Yep, there you go. It works. Perfecto. Alright, so let's get rid of all of this stuff that I don't need. I have a whole bunch of aid, by the way. A lot of alcohol, thanks to the holiday gifts, by the way. I wasn't lucky, I haven't got a single... Uh, you know, the good reward of plants, you know, the Santa that you can put on the wall, and I think there were some lights as well. I got none of that, unfortunately. Although I had a little bit over 600 gifts, it was around 70 large ones, 150 medium ones, and the rest were the small ones, so I guess I wasn't lucky. Alright, uh, so, so far we've complete. Oh, whoops. We've completed the cryptid. Oh, wait. We've completed these two. Let's go to the terminal. 
the first terminal that crosses my mind is at this power plant. So if you fast travel over there and enter through the main entrance, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure I'm not. Uh, all right, so this is where we end up spawning once we fast travel and uh, you will need to run to the main entrance. Uh, man, I forgot which one. I think it's this one, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this is the entrance. So one, this is where you'll appear once you go through that entrance. You'll need to run this way, that way, kill the enemies. Oh my god, and I got shot. <laughs> Wow, I didn't notice I had that very little health, too much radiation, huh? So basically, that's where you appear, you walk over here, and there's the terminal, right there. No enemies. Man, I, be I better take care of these cockroaches, they're very freaking... What the hell is that? Superman? Did you see that speed? That guy just flew through those that stair or whatever. Lol. And there's our terminal. In nine liters. Okay, that's not it. Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. And we get our atoms. Nice and easy. Our next stop will be the Hamlock Horrors. Over there we have uh, a Grafton monster that always appears and he's one of the cryptids. Alright, so this is where, where you will appear. What you'll need to do is just run straight behind this house. Turn a little bit left and you should see him. Ah, oh, there he is. <laughs> Kokoroch. Hey, what the hell? And there we go. Another quick and easy atoms. Don't forget to loot this fella. He gives acid. If you're into ammo, you're definitely looking for acid. And usually we also have here some snallagasters, but in my case, we have some stupid mutants, which don't give acid, unfortunately. Alright, uh, some guests just came in, so I'm gonna keep it short. Uh, so basically, I really freaked out this morning because I saw this uh, hack thingy and on Twitter and uh, and so on. And it actually turned out to be sort of fake news. I did make some posts on Reddit that I don't usually use, but I'm gonna start using it. And I didn't think of reading Bethesda forums. So a lot of guys pointed out that there are no hacking issues so far but still I'm gonna be playing on the private world at the moment uh, like solo probably <laughs> I don't know well uh, for now there's nothing uh, nothing bad going on so I'm really happy for that and I do apologize if I caused any inconveniences or some mess but I was uh, also concerned not only for myself but for all of us so yeah, I gotta bounce before, because I got guests already coming in, you know, <laughs> the New Year's and stage row family members just dropping in, say hello at the dinner table again. So I gotta go Z-Clan, so if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z-Clan, Gamer Z, saw from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine, and, and you all know the drill, don't forget to hit that like if this video, if you found this video beneficial, don't forget to leave your comments, please when you're commenting don't use F-bombs or bad language because they get the comments get triggered uh, and uh, those comments are not visible to other users only I can read those I read them by that delete them have that in mind uh, the other thing is do not promote third-party websites sell guns uh, caps whatever for real money that is something I do not support if you are to uh, promote such activity you will get banned if you see any of those comments visible under my videos please inform me as soon as possible using discord as the best way and speaking of discord you might want to join us uh, we're small but very active community, growing in all uh, platforms, PS4, Xbox, PC, uh, PC that would be me. <laughs> and uh, we start. I also started to promote a little bit of Nuclear Winter because I started playing Nuclear Winter and I actually enjoy it real much. And I don't think I'll have the chance to play some Nuclear Winter today myself. Although there's a very easy daily challenge is to use up 9 stim packs and you get yourself a perk card. But I don't really need perk cards no more, my build is finally ready.
But actually, there's only one card I really need, is the Adrenaline card. But anyway, this is what I'm going to call at the end. So, Z-Clan, everybody else, you have a good morning, day, and night, whatever you guys lock it at. And I'll see you on the next video. Thanks all for watching, and I'll see you later.